Carl Benz was born on the 25th of November, 1844 in Karlsruhe. He later attended the Polytechnic University there, before gaining his first practical experiences at various mechanical engineering companies. He founded his own company in 1872, the Eisengießerei und Mechanische Werkstätte. However, it was not much of a success at first. It was only the dowry of Karl's wife, Bertha, that saved them from immediate ruin. In 1877, Benz started developing a two-stroke engine, and after two years, it ran sufficiently for the first time. The patent for a gas-fueled four-stroke cycle engine was already owned at that time by the Gasmatornfabrik in Deutz. Nevertheless, Benz did patent some of his inventions, such as his engine speed regulator. A stock corporation under the name Gasmatornfabrik Mannheim was set up in 1882. Carl Benz resigned from it a short time later, though. It was only the founding of the Benz & Company Rheinische Gasmatorenfabrik together with the entrepreneurs Max Rosen and Friedrich Wilhelm Esslinger that led Benz to eventual success. The company, established in 1883, expanded quickly and was even able to grant licenses for the construction of gas-fueled engines. For Benz, it finally became possible to devote his time to the development of the car engine. Unlike Daimler, who integrated his engine into a carriage, Carl Benz was aiming for the development of an entire vehicle. In 1886, he was able to present his first Benz patent motor car to the public, a three-wheeled vehicle powered by a four-stroke gasoline engine. From 1885 to 87, three models with slight variations were produced. With the so-called Model 3, Bertha Benz undertook the first long-distance drive in the world in 1888. At a distance of 100 kilometers from Mannheim to Pforzheim, she experienced an adventurous drive, without her husband, but with her sons. She only let him know after a happy arrival. In 1893, Carl Benz introduced axle pivot steering to car construction, followed three years later by the Contra engine, the ancestor of today's piston engine. The breakthrough for Benz and company came in 1894 with the Velo. This light and budget-priced automobile was manufactured for five years. With a total production sum of about 1,200 units, it was the first mass-produced car in the history of the automobile. At the turn of the century, Benz & Company grew to be the leading manufacturer of automobiles in the world, with over 430 employees at the time. Carl Benz left the company two years later on account of discrepancies with the management. Together with his son Eugen, he established a new company in Ladenburg in 1906. Until the mid-twenties, the Benz and Zerner cars were produced there. As taxis, they gained a certain degree of recognition, especially in England. As opposed to Gottlieb Daimler, who died 1900, it was granted to Carl Benz to witness the boom of motorization and the final breakthrough of his idea. Carl Benz, one of the fathers of the automobile, died in 1929 at his house in Ladenburg. This channel Old Benz. Thank you for attention. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel.